In this video, we're going to go over how to utilize the irrigation dashboard found in Portal 2.0. To begin, we'll click on the irrigation tab found at the top of the portal. If you haven't created any irrigation programs yet, you will see a default placeholder screen just like this. Simply navigate down to the bottom right of the page and click Create New to create a new program of your choice. Once you have your programs created, you'll find them displayed underneath the real-time visual valve chart. Each active program is shown above to give insight into every timer that is scheduled to activate that day. Hovering over each event will display relevant data such as the valve being opened and the exact time frame of the event. Seeing all events lined up in this fashion can serve as a useful tool to help you avoid triggering more volume at any given time than your pump can handle. Moving back down to the program list below, we'll find our program sorted by name, sensor, program type, and whether or not they are currently active. On the far right hand side of each program, we will find three icons. The pencil icon, also known as the edit button, will take us to that specific program's editing wizard, allowing us to view suggestions and visualize the changes that we wish to make using the interactive graph. The clock icon will display the suggestion and change history for that program. On this page, we can look back and see any changes that were made either by the user or by autopilot. We can also see a log of all suggestions given by the copilot program if applicable. The trash can icon is used to delete a program permanently. The downward arrow to the very right of these icons can be used to quick edit the program, meaning make program adjustments without leaving the irrigation dashboard. Timer events can be edited, enabled, disabled, added, or deleted, all from inside the quick edit dropdown. Once changes are made, simply save or discard the changes to apply. You will see a live update on the real-time visual valve chart above displaying the changes you have made. The compress all and expand all buttons found in the top right can be used to quickly open or close all quick edit dropdowns at the same time. Once everything looks good, you're free to navigate off the irrigation tab to explore the rest of the web portal.